Oh, uh, it is Tuesday. Good morning. I'm Teo Torres and I'm Tony Valliera. Let's check on today's forecast. We'll do that in a minute, but we want to start with our latest headlines on the coronavirus. A Stockton teaming up with a public safety app called Citizen. It will alert users who potentially been exposed to COVID-19. South Africa, which had one of the strictest lockdowns for five months, relaxed restrictions today. It comes after the country saw a decrease in new cases. South Korea is suspending in person church services after recent outbreaks in Seoul and surrounding provinces. Data Fitzpatrick joins us from home with a look at the latest coronavirus numbers in California. Good morning. Good morning, Tony and Teo. And yes, Johns Hopkins University is reporting 10,000 new cases in California. That is, however, as hospitalizations and ICU visits have been going down. So with the new cases over the last day, California has now reported a total of 634,000 during the pandemic. 104 people across the state died from the virus since this time yesterday, and the death toll now stands at 11,000. Hospitalizations, as I mentioned, are continuing to drop. The state's Department of Health says there were fewer than 5,000 patients in the hospital Sunday. That number hasn't been that low since late June. And the number of patients in intensive care is also trending down. There were fewer than 1,600 people in the ICU on Sunday. That number hasn't been that low since late June. So huge improvement there. We'll continue seeing if these numbers continue going down when the state releases the latest numbers coming up a little later on today. Tao and Tony, back to you. All right, Deirdre, thank you.